2010. Look out. Uh -oh. Trouble for Matt Kenton. Last year's winner just barely misses the wall. Brings out our eighth caution now. Okay, put the set of tires on it. Get it tighter. I'm okay here. Well, if you see that left front tire, that really yeah, kills gotta, the way they run. Yeah, they need to fix that fender and get some tires. I'll tell you what, I was amazed how fast the 18 and 20 car ran with no tires out there. Those guys ran much better than I anticipated. You saw Kyle Busch, little freaked out. Got his more confidence now. Flat right front as well for the 16. He was running 15th at the time. He gets right in the corner. Looks like Trevor Bain got into him a little bit there. Yeah, Trevor got sideways going at turn three and just got up into him, collected him, got him in the wall too. Let's go on board with Justin Allgaier. Yeah, Justin just gets out of the throttle, stands back in the gas, gets past him. It's Coleman Presley right in front of him that also got through. He's doing a nice job. He's running 17th right now, guys. Here comes Kyle taking a peek underneath, but he's nowhere near close enough. For Denny Hamlin, his last win was oh, Kansas. Oh, no. Kenseth into the wall even harder this time. Yeah, that'll end his night right there. And our ninth caution of the event. The record, if you're wondering, is 10. Three times, including last year. So the man who won this race last year, I think it's safe to say he is definitely not going to finish it tonight. Now the lady claims him tonight for sure. Man. She giveth, she taketh away. Ron Scott also got some damage here. Let's go back and uh, see if uh, this damage was all part of this damage on the 16. It's right here, Stanton Barrett racing Paul Menard. Scott comes around. Ryan Scott just goes around. This car's nowhere to go, and Matt just gets forced down to that inside wall. That was Tony Raines that took evasive action, and it forced Kenseth right into the wall. Another view. Yeah, you can see right now, he's just a victim. You see the 11 car have spins, gets in the wall. Everybody starts taking a base of action, gets down low, and Ken says, just can't hold on to it. Oops. And uh, it's just been a bad night. And that's Darlington, man. It just happens. Yeah. And it happens Rough. late in the race. We've got 11 laps to go. <laughs> you got to believe these drivers are all jacked up going, hey, I got another caution. I got another chance to get another spot, and I'm going to try to get it. There's just no give and take right now. It's all take. All right, by the time we go back to green flag racing, we'll be within 10 laps or less. Take one more look at it as we head to commercial here at Darlington. Don't go anywhere because this is still not over. All right, uh, Dave Burns has caught up with Matt Kenseth at the Infield Care Center. Yeah, Marty, he took a big hit on the uh, on the, uh, the wall there. And Matt, uh, obviously the 11, the issue there, but sum up your night as well, and how are you feeling right now? <laughs> Frustrated. It was uh, it was tough. You know, I want to thank Coupons.com for sponsoring this thing for these two races. And uh, I love working with any of them guys. And we, we were pretty good at certain times tonight, but we were really bad on, on short runs and restarts. My car would be real loose and, and didn't have a lot of rear grip. And uh, on the restart before that, I got racing Paul and that, and then the 99 got in there and got into me a little bit and spun me out. And then coming from behind there, I saw the wreck and I turned down to miss it. And at 34, turned down pretty hard to miss it and kind of got me in the right front tire. And I just couldn't hold on to it. All right, last year's winner out tonight, Marty. And you can see the net result on the right side of your screen as we get ready for green flag racing. The cleanup crew on the front straightaway there has gotten all that uh, oil taken care of. We're waiting to see if the lights go out. It's one to go. This time by, we're being told by NASCAR.